how on earth did you end up in this industry? In glass? Yeah. Um, well, if you ask my mom, <laughs> ever since I was little, I was watching the news, always had a pen and paper. I wanted to be a journalist. Journalism came first. It didn't matter what I was talking about. It didn't matter what the story was. Telling a story for the voiceless, that was what I wanted to do. And that's what brought me here. What was the most rewarding interview you've had so far? I would say a shop owner who lost everything um, and found out because he was called, you know, by the fire department, mm -hmm. okay? He drove down to his shop or what used to be his shop and saw ashes, nothing. Everything that he had spent his life working for is now in the ground, literally. Um, speaking to him and just listening mostly, mm -hmm. and he told me how it started, he told me about the investments, he told me all the things that I wasn't really expecting, but I was glad that I got. Right. I'm sure that was really rewarding. It was, especially to find out how many people who didn't even know this guy mm -hmm. were stopping everything to help him, donating tools, money, food, clothes, anything that you can think of, just to make sure that he was okay. Mm -hmm. 